Many people make a hobby of collecting things. Stamps, antiques, or rare books. A few, however, a very few, collect anything. They even collect people. Lights out. Yeah. Check. <laughs> well, Mr. Simpson, and what are you going to do now? Look here, Martha. Look, 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 look. Yes, Henry? Uh, I've got Mr. Simpson in a pretty switch this time, haven't I? Poor Mr. Simpson. If he loses, I know I'll feel sorry for him. My, my, he has been off with it for sure. And it's been such a short game, too. Uh, let's see, you started in... Um... Huh? Uh, January, January 14th. Only two months. <laughs> He'll never play with you again if you win so easily. Well, how about it, Mr. Simpson? Do you concede? Now, Henry, don't try to rattle him or get him excited. That isn't fair. You know how you'd feel if he did that to you. All right, Mr. Simpson. <laughs> You've got until tomorrow night to figure your way out of that one. <laughs> Martha, Martha, have you seen my shopping list? It's on the table, Henry. Huh? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Henry. Yes, Martha? Come here. Yes, what is it? What is it? It's that Mrs. Uh, I don't know her name across the street. Yeah? What's she doing now? She's shaking a white cloth out the window. She's signaling. She's signaling again. They'll be here tomorrow, sure. She's taking it in now. Uh -huh. Shut the window? Yes. Lock it? Yes. Someday, someday she'll forget to lock it, and then I'll put a stop to this spying. That, uh, that wire contraption, is it still up on the roof? It's still there, and pointing this way, too. Yesterday, yesterday I passed by, the men were putting it up, and I asked them, I came out and point blank, I asked them, I said, what devilment are you up to now? You know what they said? They said something about, uh, they said about, about television. They, they said they were installing television. A likely story. Ah, they can't fool me. I know what they're doing. They're putting in a secret wireless. It's an electric eye that'll come right into this house and spy out all of our secrets. <gasps> oh, dear, dear. Then they'll, they'll know about him. Oh, no. Oh, no, they won't. I'm too clever for them. I'm going downtown this afternoon, and I'm going to buy some screen wire. And I'm going to put up screens on every opening in the house, and that will disintegrate their signals, you see? Henry, you're so wise. I'm going to miss you when you pass away. <laughs> I'll show those peepers spying on us. Do you have enough money for the screen? Yes, sir, I've got plenty. I've got some of last week's money left. Henry, haven't I told you not to save your money? Remember what happened last summer to the money you saved and hid downstairs? It's molded. Remember, it spoils if you keep it. Besides, we'll be getting our new money tomorrow. Tomorrow's the day for the new money to arrive. Yes, 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 Mother. I know, I know. I'm spending the money. I spent some today. Look, <laughs> look what I got. What is it? Let me see. Patience, Martha. Patience. <laughs> ah, there. There. See that? I... I got this in a shop downtown. See that, Martha? <gasps> Henry, it's beautiful. Yes. It's for... Yes, 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 yes. Shall we try it on? No, 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 Martha. Patience, patience. You're like a child. Don't you see? I'll put this mask over his face, and then no one will ever know. <laughs> no one will ever know. <laughs> my, this has been an exciting day. Yeah, so exciting, my dear. We've forgotten we should eat. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, Henry. I'll get it for you now. Mm -hmm. well, what have you got? Yes. Uh, I think I know. What? Not... Oranges. Oranges. Oh, this is a surprise. This is... Oh, it's Thank one you. for you. Thank you, my dear. And one for me. Thank you, my dear. Thank you. Who can that be? I look. Oh, how do you do? Is this the Potts residence? Potts? Uh, Henry, do we know anyone by that name? Potts, I've heard the name. He's heard the name? Well, they told me down at the station there was a family named Potts at this address. And then the postman on the corner pointed out this house. The postman said that? Yes. Oh, wait a minute, Martha. Is that the name on the letters we've been getting? Hmm? I believe it is. Wait, we'll look. You're right, my dear. 
This is the Potts residence. Yes. You see, we've never known the name of the people that lived here. So, of course, we've kept all their letters. See, all of this, it's been coming for years and years now. Mm. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I've got quite a collection. You see, I've arranged them all in neat little piles. The small ones here, never the large mind, ones there, the large... The girl isn't interested in your hobbies. Do you care for an orange? Oh, no, thank you very much. Henry's a great collector. Oh? We have 12 rooms in this house, and would you believe it? Every room is filled clear to the ceiling. We'll have to move out soon, you know. The woman across the street is spying on us. Yes, one of the rooms is entirely filled with bottles, the tall green ones. Won't you sit down, my dear? Oh, say, thank you very much. No, not there, not there. But you almost sat on Mr. Simpson. He's yeah. playing chess, you know. Yeah. Well, how are you coming, old man? Have you worked your way out of that corner yet? Henry and Mr. Simpson have such gay times. Tomorrow night, it will be Mr. Simpson's turn to move. And then will we have excitement. Henry will beat Mr. Simpson tomorrow night. There'll be no living with him. Oh, I, I see. Now then, show us what you have to sell. Yes, we can hardly wait. Oh, well, I have nothing to sell. I'm, I'm with the newspaper. We're taking a survey. I, I have a few questions to ask if this is the Potts residence. We decided that, my dear. Yes, uh, she's a little forgetful, poor thing. So young, too. Yes. Will you... Would you care to sell me your shoes? Sell you my shoes? Yes. Oh, now, look, I think I better There, go. there, my dear Henry, so impractical. She needs her shoes, Henry. We all need our shoes. Without them, our feet would wear mm. out. Maybe you'll sell us your black book. It's very pretty. Black is such a restful color. Oh, no, I... I couldn't sell it. You see, it doesn't belong to me. Look, Martha, look, look, look. It's just like the one I have. Why, so it is. Yes. Will you have a book like this one? Yes, yes, of course. May I see it? Why, why, certainly, yes, it's here somewhere. Oh, uh, this is our survey report. See here on the cover, Daily Sun. My, my, what a queer name for a girl. Uh, do you have a large family? Uh, oh, why, no, uh, I'm alone. My uh, parents are dead. Here, here it is, here it is, just like that, well, didn't I oh, tell you? I see it? Yes. Yes, 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 look at it. Be, be very careful. It's the only one I have. Where did you get this book? Why, is there something wrong with it? This is a Daily Sun survey control book, too. I wonder. There was a young man assigned to cover this section of town three days ago. He didn't report back to the office, so I was assigned to take his place. They assumed he'd quit for some unknown reason. Yes, young men are so undependable. You said when you arrived you were looking for someone by the name of Potts? Yes. Henry, I'm going to tell her. No, 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 no. Yes, I think it's best. I'm telling you a secret. A secret that no one else knows, not even the postman. Our name used to be Potts. <laughs> we changed it, you know. But we haven't told anyone. If we did, it wouldn't be a secret. Oh, I see. That, that's very interesting, I'm sure, but... Uh, but the book, where did you get it? The young man who came here last week asking questions gave it to us. Gave it to us? Oh, yes, yes. We collect things, you know. Henry, the fine collector. Oh, yes, yes. I know you've already told me. But where is this young man? Did he tell you where he was going? Why did he give you the book? You see, they can't understand what happened to him at the office. Well, I'll tell you, my dear. He's here. Right here in this house. Oh, that's strange. Where is he? Is he ill? Why didn't he send in a report? You're just like he was. You're asking too many questions. Well, never mind. Your search is over, isn't it, Henry? Yes, I, I'm afraid it is. You know, you look rather hungry. Would you care to join us for dinner? Oh, no, thank you. I'm not hungry. Thanks just the same. Oh. You join us anyway. Yes. We were just ready to start when you <laughs> rang. There you're you are. very kind. Sit down. Now, isn't it nice? Yes. Yes, it's delightful. Now, where is this young man? Now, please don't start asking questions again. Yes, we don't like people to ask questions. The young man kept insisting we answer his questions. Yes, no, I got, I got very angry. We have many secrets, you know. Yes, yes, he insisted that we answer his but questions. But where and is so he? I... He's here, my dear. Patience, patience. We must not rush. We must be leisurely. Henry and I can afford to be just that. Oh, yes. We are very wealthy, you know. Oh, yes. Yes, you see, Mother. Mother left us all her money when she died. In trust, you know. A man comes every week and brings us some from the bank. It's very convenient. Mm hmm Come, Henry. Time to go to bed. Mm hmm 
You'll stay here tonight. Oh, no, no. I'll just talk to the other survey taker, and then I'll run along. It's all right. In the morning, my dear. You'll still be here in the morning. I locked the door for the night. Now, wait a minute. I'm not staying here tonight. Now, let's get that straight. I want to talk to the young man right now. You're staying here tonight, my dear. You must be so tired asking all those mm. questions all day long. Campbell, you tip for the <laughs> Not a coffin, Henry, a casket. <laughs> coffin a casket, he never knows which. You will sleep in the guest room. Come. No! No! Help! 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 You are room is upstairs, my dear. There you are. Isn't that cozy? Take the boxes and put them on the floor. They're heavy, filled with hammers. It's Henry's hammer collection. What are you going to do? You can't, you can't make me stay here. Go into your room. Be sure to lock the door. Henry walks in his sleep sometimes. He might decide to come down and look at his hammers. Are you going to bed now? Oh, yes. You see, tomorrow's going to be a big day. Then I'll go to bed, too. We'll... We'll all go to bed. And then t tomorrow... Good night, my dear. Pleasant dreams. <laughs> Good night, Martha. Good night, Henry. Sleep well, dear. Wait until morning to see him, could you, my dear? There's death in this house. I know it's dreadful. He was so ill when he arrived, we hardly had a chance to get acquainted before he died. We'll have the funeral tomorrow night. Just you and Henry and I. Then we'll lay him away with the other caskets. Oh, Henry has a whole room full of caskets. It's his casket collection. He started it when Mother died. Please, please let me go into town. We should make proper arrangements. No. Well, what do you intend to do? We'll take care of everything ourselves. There's no need to bring in the outsiders. But what are you going to do? You, you can't keep me a prisoner here forever. No, darling, not forever. You'll stay with us for a few days. You'll see that we're right when you've had time to think it over. We wouldn't want the outsiders in our home. They'll discover our secret. What secret? Tell me, what secret? That Martha's insane. Oh, 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 oh. Shame on you, Henry, you and your little jokes. The poor girl's almost done in. She found out about the boy last night. Really? And of course she understands why we must maintain our secret. Well, I tried to explain, but the poor girl thinks she should notify the police. The police? Oh. That is too bad. Dear. Are you going shopping this morning, Henry? Yes, dear, I'm eating right now. Do you have your list? Yes, I have my list, dear. I think you'd better get another. What? Oh, yes, 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 sure. Surely, surely. I dare say you're right. Oh. Well, have you a pencil? I'd better write it down. I'll go get one for you. Are you leaving now? Uh, yes, I always like to shop this time of the morning. It's cooler, you know. But first, first I've got to take a look at our friend across the street and see what she's doing. She, she spies on us, you know. Uh, uh, oh. 
where you would be. <laughs> Some of these days, I find a friend I'm going to fix you for good. I'll show you who you can spy on and who you can't spy on. <laughs> uh, you in the contraption that you're putting up. I'll show you. Whatever you want. What is that? What do you do? Oh, I'm so sorry. Did, did I frighten you? What do you want? Well, what do you see? <laughs> it's that woman across the street. She's sweeping off the sidewalk. You know why she's sweeping off the sidewalk? No. <laughs> why does she do that? She's sweeping away the footprints of those men who were there last night. Now, what are you two up to now? It's that woman across the street. She's up to her old tricks again. We'll soon put a stop to that. Here's your pencil, Henry. Thank you, dear. Take those glasses. Look, look, look. See if you see what I see. Well, I'm, uh, I'm going now, Martha. Hurry back, Henry. The young lady and I will have our breakfast while you're gone. I will. I won't be gone more than an hour, dear. You may look at Henry's hammers if you like, dear. How do you do? What do you want? Well, am I supposed to come in? Come in? Yes, I came for the reward. Reward? Yes, the note that I saw on the man's back downtown. I'm afraid I don't understand. <laughs> well, it said to come to this address to receive a reward. I thought it was, well, maybe a contest of some kind. You know, like on the radio. Help not... me, Neil! What's that? It's my sister. She's uh, not quite right. Oh, I see. We put her in there when strangers come. Sometimes she's violent. Is that so? Yes, she collects hammers, poor things. Has a whole room full up there. Please, Mr. Would you care to see them? Uh, no, no, thank you. I, uh, I think I'd better be going. Do you notice anything peculiar about this room? Well, it's, uh, it's interesting. It's, uh, kind of dark, but it looks, looks very unusual. You probably also noticed the iron bars on the windows when you came in. Yeah. We had to put them on to keep her in. Uh, good day, ma'am. I'm sorry I disturbed uh, you. Ah, just a minute. Please don't say anything about this. We prefer to keep her here ourselves rather than send her to one of those... Horrible places for the insane. Oh, sure, sure. Uh, you see that box over there? Yes, it looks like a coffin. She fixed it up to look like one. It's really a box. She thinks there's a body in the box. Would you care to come over and look inside uh, it? No, 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 thank you. I, uh, I understand. Well, uh, goodbye. Uh, I wonder why he didn't want to look in the casket. You asked him to look in the casket. Well, of course, my dear. <laughs> Henry always calls them coffins. You see, we have nothing to hide. We're <laughs> only trying to protect <laughs> you, that's all. Oh, no. no. Please go to your room, my dear. And get some sleep. You're still tired from your long day yesterday. Besides, you didn't sleep a bit last night. Oh. Ellen, <laughs> not this minute you're sitting on Mr. Simpson. Oh, no! I'm sorry, Mr. Simpson. I hope she wasn't too heavy. Where is it? Where is it? Don't keep me in suspense. Where is it? Where is what, Henry? Where's the reward? Reward? Yes. You're the second person who's come for the reward. Oh, then I'm too late. No, Henry, you're not too late. Oh, well, then I get the reward. Look, you see, I found this on my back. Rather, some woman did. She took it off and she gave it to me. She said she thought it was some sort of a joke, but I knew better. I get the reward. I get the reward. I get the reward. Yes, Henry, I get you the reward. get the reward. I get the reward. Here. Here, Henry, is your reward. Oh, you mean, uh... Yes, I'm sure she was sent here to spy on us. Yes, I've been worrying about her sleeping on that bed up in that room. I have no place to put my hammer collection. <laughs> did you order the flowers? Yes, dear, yes, I did, I did, I did. The father said he'd send them out today. I got a very good buy on them, too. They were, they were wilted, just a little. Well, that will be nice. I think you'd better do it now. <laughs> I did it! I did it! I have got it! 
I've got it, I've got but it. But that's look, look. fine, Henry. Look, look, look. Uh, Henry, what have you done? The girl has the knife. It's all right, Martha. Don't be worried. I traded her the knife for the book. And in addition, she's going down to the office, and she's going to send the rest of the survey takers here. There are over 50 of them, she yes. says. Yes? Yes, don't you see? Then I'll get over 50 books for my collection. Well? Yes. Oh, this, this, this is exciting. Well? Oh, all right, Henry, if this is what you want. Right. Run along, dear. Run along, run along. Hurry up now, hurry up, hurry up. And you send the others out here. You send them right along. I'll open the door for you, dear. Oh. There you go. Hurry back now. I wonder... I wonder how many more than 50 there'll be. I don't know, Henry. Uh, Henry, that girl, she was crazy too, don't you think? Oh, definitely. Just like the boy. Well, all 50 of them must be crazy. Yes. Imagine going around counting people. Yes. 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 Uh, and they'll all be coming here, one by one. Henry, it's good what we'll be doing. We'll soon have this insanity stamped out forever. Oh, indeed, yes, yes. And as soon as they are gone, my work will be completed. <laughs> well, that is uh, almost completed. <laughs> shoe is on the other foot. Mr. and Mrs. Potts are about to be collected by the man in the white coat. <laughs> <laughs> 